said nine points of articulation, you'll have to buy me dinner first. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Kent. I've never been with a man sophisticated enough to own a real Valerian steel dagger. Well. If you think that's impressive, you should check out the life-size replica of the Millennium Falcon I have parked outside my garage. Or should I say, Docking Bay 94. <laughs> I'd love to see your Docking Bay. Ooh. Ooh. Mm. Mm. You know, Veronica, hiring you is best thing that ever happened to me. Kent? Kent? You don't really expect her to be enchanted with all this crap, do you? No. Can't be. <laughs> Josie? That's not even a real home-cooked meal. You just microwaved it. <laughs> That's not true. <laughs> yes! yes! Okay, fine! We're on sale! Ah! 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 Veronica, you should run. Just get out of here before. <laughs> yes, she'll run. Anything to get away from a pathetic loser like you. A loser who has a ton of meaningless things to do. Like... Just a dream, like Secret Invasion should have been. Metro City, WKRB, I'm Stan. And I'm Jessica. Jessica, I would stay off the roads this morning. That's true, this weather is dark and ominous, for sure. It is, it's spooky out there. I mean, you'd have to be an absolute lunatic to go outside this morning. And you don't want to go outside if there's lunatics out in this storm. You know, I wouldn't be surprised to see just hordes of zombies just spiraling towards you. Next topic, what is on my face? We're gonna find out. I'm gonna find out. New comic book day. I'm here every new comic book day. That's not what I'm asking. You're here every day, period. What I want to know is what you're doing here now. How did you even get inside? I phased through. 
with my kitty pride phasing ability. Also, your back door is unlocked. That's good. That's good. Well, why don't we leave every door unlocked in the whole building? Because, hey, it's not like there's a lunatic outside zipping around in the Sonic the Hedgehog outfit, scaring the bejesus out of me. You really should take care of that. If you're not out of here in two minutes, I will burn this place to the ground! Whoa, jeez, calm down, Kent. Here, I got you some coffee. Bavarian cream chai chocolatino with Parmesan cheese? Of course. I just haven't been myself lately. I... Whoa, hey, was it the Josie dream again, boss? <laughs> Jesus, Adam, no, I wasn't dreaming about my evil ex. Oh, well, was it the one where you wake up naked in the TARDIS next to David? <laughs> what the hell, man? No! Oh, well, was it the one where you're stuck in Spider-Man 3 and you just can't stop dancing? <laughs> For your information, I was dreaming about Veronica! Hi! Veronica, uh, so good to see you. Uh, hey, uh, uh, nice. Is that your uh, your favorite superhero? <laughs> oh, Harry Potter? No, Beyonce. Huh. Anyway, uh, sorry that I couldn't be here earlier to uh, properly demonstrate the correct method of sorting and shelving the new issues. I, uh, I trust that Adam is showing you the ropes? I mean, kind of. It's just... I don't really understand the crazy way he sorts the comics. The, they're in alphabetical order. See, that doesn't make any sense. Whoa, 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 whoa. Slow down, Professor Zoom. This is her first time shelving the new issues. We can't expect her to suddenly grasp every single nuance, A, B, C, and so forth. Especially when we're faced with the looming threat of thousands of nerds circling this place like psoriasis-infested sharks, just waiting to take a bite into our fresh bucket of comic book chum. Speaking of which, is that that one guy still out there? Yep, still here. Bubsy Bobcat's ghost. All right, everybody, uh, emergency meeting in the back room. Come on, come on, away from the window. Quick, 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 quick. Let's go. Back room. Hustle, people. Hustle. Ugh. Fellow employees of the destination, and Jake. As you know, today is a day that can break the spirit of even the most seasoned comic book shop employee. Not to mention, it's the first new comic book day for our newest recruit, the lovely and leggy Veronica Bloom. Oh my god, did you really just say leggy? Yeah, I'll say. She's got gams for days. Guys, don't you think you're being super sexist here? No, they're right. I've got great legs and I'm super hot. Okay, let's move on. You, you know for what it's worth, Zoe. No, Adam. You, you also have legs. I will kill you if you don't stop. You know how to use them. Go, next topic, Kent. It's like this easy top song. What? What? Belay that chatter, people. My god, it's gonna be a slobber knocker this week. Two A-listers dying, one B-lister coming back from the grave. Now those doors are gonna open momentarily. And when they do, not only will we have to contend with Sonic Guy Steve, but we're gonna have a veritable legion of nerds sweating, panting, reeking of Cool Ranch Doritos and Monster Energy Drink, desperate to get their fingers on the newest adventures of their favorite costume vigilante. And I'll be damned if we're too overwhelmed to handle it because we're too busy talking about legs and how to use them. This will be our day. The day we stood up with one voice and said, we will not go quietly into the night. We will not vanish without a fight. We're going to live on. We're going to survive. Today, we celebrate our new comic book day. Store opens at 0900. Battle stations, people. Adam. Man the shelves. Yeah! Zoe, woe man the cash register. Veronica, make sure the comics are still made out of paper. Jake, don't touch anything.
I ask you something? Ahem. Permission to speak freely, Captain. Permission granted, Lieutenant Commander. Are you sure Veronica is going to work out? Of course. I wouldn't have hired her if I thought she wouldn't. I mean, come on, she's smart. She's pretty. She's funny. She's pretty. She calls Taylor Swift Tay-Tay, which I can't help but find endearing. And she's pretty. All right, damn your eyes. She happens to be pretty-ish. Uh, what is your point? You're pursuing her based on her looks, oh. and I don't want her to turn into another Josie. Don't say her name. You know the rules. We never say her name. Besides, I'm totally over her. Are you sure? Because I've seen you taking the long way home. You keep revisiting the spot where you two broke up? She gunned my heart down in Crime Alley, but I'll deal with it in my own way, in my own time. Okay, sorry, I just care for your well-being. I know, I, I appreciate your concern, really, but I'm fine. I hired Veronica out of nothing but the purest of intentions. Besides, I think she'll be a great fit here at the destination. Um, so is Wolverine called Wolverine because he's part wolf, part tangerine? That's a very good theory, Veronica. I, I'd never considered it that way before. Very Grant Morrison of you. Uh, thanks. <laughs> Do you see what I'm saying? Hey, Jimin! Can you feel that? Bright lady, preserve us. It's time. Adam. Unlock the door. Brace yourselves! We've got fanboys incoming! Jumpin' Jack Kirby. That was the busiest new comic book day we've ever had! Yippee! We did it, guys! I'm gonna go get me an Egg McMuff. Woo! <laughs> Furby reference.